Welcome everyone, the first step to factory reset your iPhone is we're going to open up the settings and inside of the settings you should see your name at the top and I want you to tap on your name and then you're going to see this one, iCloud, select iCloud and we're going to start off by creating an iCloud backup so all of your data is saved. So we're going to tap on the iCloud backup. And before we do the factory reset, I want you to tap on backup now. And this will save all of your data to the cloud for if you get a new device and you want to restore it. And we have completed the backup. So now let's head out of the backup settings. And we're going to head out of the iCloud settings. And when we see the Apple ID screen, I want you to scroll all the way down to the bottom and you're going to see the sign out here. I want you to tap on sign out. It's going to ask you for your Apple ID password. And this is required to remove the Find My iPhone protection. This just prevents thieves from stealing your phone as we're factory resetting, uh, let's remove that protection so the new owner isn't locked out. It will ask what data to keep. Because we're factory resetting, there is no need to turn any of these on. And so we're going to sign out. Uh, we're going to sign out one more time. And now we're going to wait for this to finish. Once we have signed out, I want you to scroll all the way down until you see general. And we are in the settings app here. And then you're going to scroll to the very bottom and you're going to see transfer or reset iPhone on the older software. This will just say reset. And then you're going to see this one, erase all content and settings. So you're going to tap this one here. It's going to say that everything will be erased. So we're going to tap on continue. If we are ready, it may ask for your passcode. If you have one, enter that one in. And then we're going to select erase. And now your iPhone will be resetting to its factory default. Everything will be removed, your photos, your data, your apps, your contacts. So the new owner, if you're transferring this to someone, will not see any of that information. It will all be erased. And now our iPhone is on the hello screen, but there's one more thing we need to do. And that is if you have a SIM card in your iPhone, we will need to remove the SIM card. So if you transfer the phone, you know, they won't have that SIM card inside. To do this, we first need the SIM ejector tool. And if you have your iPhone box, it will be, uh, the tool will be inside of there. You can use a paper clip or a pin if you'd like. And so either on the left or the right hand side, you're going to see this outline in a hole here. This is the SIM card tray. And you just want to place the SIM ejector tool into the hole of the SIM card tray. And push down until you feel a click. And then use your nails to remove the SIM card tray, flip the tray over and the SIM card will come out and then line the hole of the SIM card tray with the hole of the iPhone and just place this one back in and now your iPhone is ready to be sold, ready to be gave to someone else. Please do consider leaving a like. Bye bye.